be it enacted by the General Assembly of Maryland that Charles W. Galloway, Edward B. Gregg, J. Albert Burton, T. Parkin Scott, Edward E. Harold, Benjamin B. Barber, George Bowen, S.C. Tanner, J.J. Haynes, Charles W.S. Banks, and Robert C. Clark, all being residents of Baltimore County, State of Maryland, and all other persons who shall hereafter become members of the Improvement Association, hereby incorporated, Relay Improvement Association of Baltimore County. I think about these gentlemen from time to time and wonder if they would recognize the village for which they felt so strongly 100 years ago that they created an Improvement Association. The roads are no longer paved with oyster shells, but asphalt, and they don't all travel the same routes they once did. The fire station was just being built in 1910 and is now our cherished town hall. Mrs. Lena's store on the corner of South Rolling Road and Railroad Avenue is gone. But the spirit of the chickens that used to roost in the trees around the store is alive and well in the yards of three neighbors that are raising chickens, albeit in coops and not the trees. Only the monument still stands where the Viaduct Hotel used to be, but they would certainly recognize the Relay Hotel and some of the homes in the neighborhood though they might be amused that we consider them historic. And while the train stop has changed, the train does still stop in relay and travels southward over the viaduct, albeit a bit faster now. And yes, that viaduct is still standing after 175 years. I hope they would be proud that the association they started 100 years ago has endured through the efforts of many neighbors. They would certainly see a strong community of neighbors who gather for covered dish dinners, provide welcome baskets to new neighbors, and maintain the old tradition of Relay Day. And a hundred years from now, I wonder if I would recognize my village of Relay. Will the association still be actively promoting the community? Will the Relay Town Hall still be lovingly maintained? And will that viaduct still be standing? I certainly hope so.